Hi people, welcome back to the Unduel Commentary. So we have Stu here. Hi. I asked you this before, but your name's not even Stu, is it? No, it's not. <laughs> How the hell did you come up with that? <laughs> How did I come up with Stu? Yeah. Oh, it's my dog's name. Oh, okay. <laughs> that makes That's sense. That's why it's Stu Dog. <laughs> okay. And, and why number eight? Just because? Because all the other ones were taken at the time. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's like, you know what? I'll be the eighth student. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, but uh, now a lot of those are have been disconnect or been deleted from YouTube. Oh, okay. So those other people who put Stu Dog in Ray's numbers were they before you too? Or are because I know you did like something about honoring other people for taking their <laughs> Stu Dog with different numbers. I'm like, did they really do that because of you? I don't know. I just did it for the wolves, but... Okay. <laughs> whatever. We have Burning Abyss here. Yeah, so we have Smog... <laughs> with 814. He's in Burning Abyss. And he's not done. He's not done. He's gonna go into another Dante, I guess. I don't like when they go into so many Dante's first turn. I'm only doing it just because they have it. If Dante gets hit, then you have to use him more sparingly than just Dante, 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 Dante all damn day. Yeah. You least put it down to two, at least you gotta use that Dante to put back your other Dante. God. We have Moonlight Fantasy here. It's 1194. Wow, look at that experience though. 10k, man. Yeah. He got lucky off that mill. Yeah, he did. God. Is that a Fire Lake? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think about Burning Abyss and support? Um, I don't know. I haven't looked that much into it. I think it's good. <laughs> Doesn't oh. want like banish something and then. Oh, being able to search for fire lake. Yeah, that's yeah. That's 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 fair. <laughs> <laughs> so Shadolf. Oh, we know it's not emptiness set. <laughs> yeah, it's not emptiness because there's emptiness. He would have hit him with that already. Yep. All right, and looks like he's gonna go ahead and go for the aggressive dark arm to play too. It's a really, really interesting play. Like I said, Eclipse Wyvern is just an interesting card. Yeah. I'm gonna go Dragon, try to bait out the Fire Lake now. <laughs> oh, now you're gonna try to do that? Yes. Wonder if we'll chain it. It probably won't. What you got? Wow. Oh. Uh, and you didn't chain it. Why? Misclick. Uh oh. Okay, I guess he is. Oh, okay. There we go. Put that back. You can still summon Dark Arm as long as he has a, what, uh, one of the baby Chaos Dragons to banish the Eclipse Wyvern. Get Dark Arm, summon Dark Arm, because he has exactly three, because that play sets up exactly three. <laughs> yep. Go ahead and summon it. Time. That field. <laughs> I know. Look at all the floating and all the he. He'll come right back into the duel. Yup, he has it. Yep. So. Yeah, yeah. Wonder how many he runs. Probably three, two or three. I don't know. I saw some of them only running one of uh, the black one since there's not a lot of lights in the deck. It could be a dead draw. But I guess once you get it started, they can simply just touch each other. So. Yeah, at least, I would say at least two of each of them. They probably play three of the the light and two of the dark. Mm. I don't like Shadol, so I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I've never played them. <laughs> they're, they're not my cup of tea. I'm a control player, and they're way too aggressive now. Yeah, I mean, you have a combo just for summoning Dark Arm. Like, that. that that's too much for me. I don't even like Dark Arm like that. I know, oh, I never get it set up. Probably gonna go Dweller and then Dark Garden. Yep. Yep, oh, yeah. that's gonna hurt. Yeah, that hurts. That's smart. Yep, he just scooped <laughs> it out. He's like, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> He's like, I can't fly. That's what you get for going with all them Dantes and shit. Yeah, well, that was a great comeback to, to win it. Well, not on his first turn, man. No, no. Yeah. God, the deck is aggressive. Yeah. 
I'm surprised he didn't just drop the dental sucker on his ass. Probably didn't have it. He would have summoned it. <laughs> yeah. Just to not get fire laked. <laughs> just God, running abyss. <laughs> that was a good play, though. I'll give it to him. I want to see how this duel ends. They side it up. He's letting Shadows go first. I think that's a smart move. <laughs> yeah, that's smart. Shadows hate going first. I said they're such an aggressive deck, they like to go second. I don't like that either. Yeah, it just sets two, so I mean. <laughs> Probably not me back row. Unless he sided into some back row. I'm guessing it'd be like MST and maybe Shadow Games as he played it. No, I actually got something. Chain. El Shadow? Yeah. El Shadow plus core. Okay. Okay. Well, like I said, not back row. <laughs> that was my other guess. Like maybe one core and maybe an El Shadow fusion, but not much. <laughs> So Where does Tour able... God go in that? Because literally, it seems like he misplayed that. Like when? When he used Tour Guide effect, he'll chain... Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. He went Tour Guide effect, chain El Shadal Fusion, summon... Fuse, summon Window, then Tour God goes. Then he gets his graveyard effects. Yeah, he, he did that wrong. <laughs> Huh, doesn't like, even I, matter. Yeah, because I'm like, how are all your graveyard effects going off before Tour Guide resolves? Like, the chain hasn't even resolved yet, but that's the end <laughs> for you. They're just like, you know what, I'm just going to do whatever I do. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I did a recording this morning of someone who saw the morning of Virgil, and then he tried to get it back with Sir, and no one even cared. Mm -mm. <laughs> I was like, are you kidding me? <laughs> and he, he won because of that. Wow. Cheap. And you didn't want to just like highlight their names and freaking go in public chat and message them privately and just be like, you know, you fucked up, right? Nah, it's not even worth it. I saw that kind of look. Flip with their vanities already. It's vanities time. Yup. Man, I talked about how I feel about vanities in yesterday's the end of commentary slate. Oh, speaking of slate, he got busy and he couldn't make it, so. <laughs> yeah, like, that's what I assumed. I'm like, you know, it's your day, man. <laughs> like, that's the whole point. He hasn't done a video in like a month, I think. I uh, know he hasn't. No. Just, his videos are actually pretty good, so I mean. Uh. That's actually one of the reasons why I want to get you on on daily tools just to shut up Slate. <laughs> <laughs> you never, you know, did you watch the episode where Slate said that he's the best tag partner because he has the most subs? <laughs> <laughs> really? What's the logic in that? I'm like, so if I had Stu Dog, then he's better than everybody. He's better than me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I didn't see Slates yet. It was 51 minutes. I saw Omega Chaoses this morning. It wasn't that episode. It was a previous episode a while ago. But yeah, you know how it is with tech partners. We generally duel and just find that we get that last duel, which takes freaking a millennium. Yeah. Just know we went against freaking Shadals. And you know how I feel about Shadals, especially when using Heraldics. It's just like, wow, all right. Can I just scoop now? <laughs> I know so you're actually gonna... dueled it out? Yeah, we dueled it out. We still lost, but... We tried. <laughs> uh, thanks for spoiling it. <laughs> oh, I mean, it's not much. You know, we get punished for doing what we do, which is kind of dumb. You know, I get punished with Shadow Fusion because I XC, and the other guy is using Zombie, so, you know, he summons, um. Oh my god, what's that one that gains half your. But his attack is half your opponent's life points? I forgot his name. The level 5 zombie guy? I have no idea. <laughs> I can't remember. Endless Decay. Yeah. He summons Endless Decay, and of course, half our, you know, half your opponent's life points in a tag duel, so you already know that guy's a fucking big-ass beater. <laughs> yup. Like, oh, great. <laughs> like, that feels just as cheating as freaking Ancient Leaf in tag duels. It's burning Abyss player is in a good position. Mm-hmm. Just depends if Moonlight has another fusion. Hopefully, because <laughs> that deck is really anticlimactic without fusion. Yep. I'm actually kind of worried about Shadals because, you know, they probably want to play Neff Shadal Fusion just for the consistency of the fusion, but, you know, with this three triple MST format, you know, what else are you MSTing in Shadals? 
And he lost connection. Okay. <laughs> he just straight up, he just said, are you there? And he just quit, like... You yeah. know you could have called an admin and, you know, got the victory. If his smug actually went AFK, but whatever. Impatient, that's what you get. <laughs> yep. Alright, let's go ahead and get one more single duel in. Alright, get back. Oh, uh, AJ DeBomless. I've dueled this guy at a regional before. No, oh, really? <laughs> yeah, he's AJ Jones. Okay. <laughs> is. This guy is hot cards. <laughs> 11.45 in... Well, he's got a ton of experience. Yeah, 13k, man. Damn. <laughs> so he just... He's getting back into it. He wants to get his rating back up. After yeah. After doing less. <laughs> What's this? Life Storms? Batterman. Batterman play Card Trooper? I don't even think they play Threatening Roy, but... Whatever. Okay. <laughs> like, okay... <laughs> Catching me off guard. Not the biggest Battery Man fan, but I didn't know they played stuff like that. Like, what's the synergy with Card Trooper? No stuff for Call the Haunted, I guess. Which I don't even think that's worth it, but. Alright. <laughs> I don't like any of that. <laughs> Damn. I just throw pots at the grave. I wonder what this is. Seriously. Not a lot of decks play. Tour Guide and Thunder King. <laughs> Truffle. <laughs> Thunder King. Pack. Thunder King. How, how badly does that hurt Battery Men? Pretty bad if they don't have Call the Haunted. I mean, if they're playing Thunder Seahorse, it yeah. just stops that. Stops Pod Duality and their Stop. Searcher guy. Yeah, it stops Nine Ball. I mean, Nine Ball can. Does Nightball have to search to gain the attack? Yeah. Damn. It's gonna go in space. And it is a... Chain MST. <laughs> no, Chain MST to the MST. No, oh, no. Tarantal. People still play Tarantal? I don't. <laughs> I learned that one the hard way. <laughs> I didn't even really like Tarantal when it was popular. Yeah, when it, when it was at two, it was pretty nice. Mm -hmm. But you just, you always had to fear it. Yeah. Now it jumps out the bushes and stabs you. It's like, oh, didn't see that coming. Noted. What the heck is this? Seriously, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I've never seen that guy before. Okay. I made my my own rule for myself with Noden. My rule is if you play Noden that you should only ha you should only be able to play one uh insta fusion. Yeah, I guess it's that one. And OCG, like I say, if you're gonna play O C G card you should play by OCG rules. It's not really fair. You can just be like, Oh, three insta fusions and Noden. Like they didn't get here hit here in T C G like 'cause it's not out here in T C G. Konami would, that... Konami would probably wreck that shit. Oh yeah. That Valor hurt. Yeah, that Valor time. hurt big time. God. He's probably gonna summon, what? Fuel Cell? Turn it over? Reading. Why do you, you have to read Alucard? Didn't you play during Gear Gear format? Seriously, how do you not know Alucard? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Did that man just go tour guide to tour guide? <laughs> yup. Mm. I mean, uh, he, he's probably playing Squarm, so there's no point to go for it yep. since Thunder King's on the field. Damn, Thunder King, BLS, damn. Must be Chaos Stun or something, I don't know. I don't know how to, I mean, hey, you know him more than I do. <laughs> what did he play yeah. against you in the region? It was just a long time ago. Constellars. Oh, okay. What were you playing? Gear Gear. Oh, <laughs> and how did that go? I won that, but I played him before. He was using Piper, and I was using Agents, and he beat me in that one. Why but... didn't Thunder King attack? Good question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Hi, cards. You're running out of resources, man. <laughs> and if you kill that Thunder King, then you just got nothing. You got BLS coming at you. Really? Phoenix Wing Wind Blast? Like, that's a neg. <laughs> what do you look. Who do you think you are, Burning Abyss? <laughs> <laughs> now battery men don't float. They wish they did. Oh, he gains the attack from himself, does he? Oh yeah. No, yeah, it does gain the attack from himself. My bad. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's the top deck of the century. <laughs> Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so balanced, right? No, not even close. <laughs> I'm sorry, that should be banned immediately. It shouldn't have been unbanned. As soon as I saw a card, I was just shaking my head and like, Konami, that's dumb. Like, no. And that was before I even remembered Hidden Armory. I, I was just thinking of the card on its own merit. Like, that's dumb. That was Hidden Armory too? Didn't him, isn't him, Hidden Armory like a $5 column because of that shit? Yep. Mm -hmm. I completely forgot about it until you mentioned your videos. I'm like, oh, wow. <laughs> and then I didn't remember uh, Swords at Dawn until uh, the Ignoble Night of YouTube, and I saw that, and I'm like, oh, wow. <laughs> just enough to just end the duel. You know? And I already hate freaking uh, mind control, let alone Snap Steel. <laughs> I freaking dueled someone a while ago when, I think it was in... Uh, Chaos Dragon format, and literally every single duel he got hit in armory, and we did we did three duels, and he fucked me up through each method of uh, mind control. So exceed synchro and... and and took it and hit me for game. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I was like, wow, all right. <laughs> like, mind control, XC, like I hate you. Like mind control, synchro, I hate you more. Like mind control, you, you bell, and then summon something and poke you directly for game. Like I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> that's harsh. So he's playing Piper in his good old fun deck. Yep, that's a good old fun deck. GG. <laughs> so, but uh, it's not good enough to beat Snatch Steel, I guess. No, not even. <laughs> it was the Snatch Steel that won. I know, like, literally, there's no other way you would have won. Mm -mm, like, hey, you know, BLS wins games. Especially when you take it from your opponent with Snatch Steel. <laughs> yup. Oh my god, ridiculous. Alright, that was fun. Alright, yeah. so thank you for joining me, Mr. Stu. No problem. Tommy's dad. Yep. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, all my 90s kids out there got that. <laughs> Alright, so I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and we'll see you guys next weekend with some more Dealing Duel commentary. Alright guys, thanks for watching.